Okay, this is going to be my separate discussion about the uh, fantasy um, books. I wasn't, I had to work, so I wasn't able to um, meet up with my group at the time that we had um, our Zoom meeting set up for, and it just, it wasn't going to work at all this week. So I allowed them to do theirs separately, and then I was going to make my own video, but um, I did go back and watch theirs as well. But uh, I'm going to answer the questions on my own. So it says, what makes uh, this transitional text, meaning Mercy Watson goes for a ride, a fantasy? Well, for one, pigs don't drive. And I also don't think any farmer or whoever owns a pig would have them sitting freely in a convertible without being in a cage. Um, that and it's... I don't know. A lot of people talk to the pigs, so that's not really a fantasy type of thing. But I don't think that uh, they have as much personality, like jumping in, in the driver's seat trying to drive type of personality. Um, the word folly, uh, the way she used it in the book was kind of like nonsense or just something, something that doesn't make sense to her. Uh, some synonyms I wrote down would be uh, absurdity craziness foolishness foolishness or uh idiocy um some of the my own follies um i don't think what did i do? i think dressing up on halloween is probably like the most foolish thing me and my friends do the craziest stuff and it's just all out of fun. It, it's safe, but it, it's very fun. But that's about as crazy as I'm going to get. Um, Mr. Watson is a forward-looking man. He does not believe in looking back. The double meaning of this statement in my, in my eyes would be he doesn't look back at things in the past. He's a forward-looking man he looks towards the future and what's possible what could happen not all the negativity that happened in the past um the fantasy uh picture book i selected was i think it was never let a unicorn scribble by diane albert uh, i uploaded a video talking about that and it's similar to um mercy watson in a way that it gives it gives animals more personality than they would have i would say more human-like characteristics i would say um and they never let a unicorn scribble um well one unicorns don't exist so no one would have it as a pet and a pet pig wouldn't be driving and having as much freedom just like a unicorn wouldn't be scribbling so that's kind of the similarity uh of it but the only difference is unicorns don't exist as far as we know i guess <laughs> and you can't have it as a pet um other books that kate de camillo has written um bank and goldie Great Joy, The Magician's Elephant, uh, Mercy Watson to the Rescue, The Tale of Despero, and Because of When Dixie. I think Because of When Dixie is a movie or we read it in class one year, but it sounds very familiar to me. I do, I do believe that it's a movie. I don't know. But I, that, yeah, that's something that I did read in school. But on my own, I haven't read any of her books but the ones that I will get from the library that sounds really good is The Magician's Elephant and The Tale of Despero. Those are two. Those look interesting to me. Um, let's see. Yeah, that's all. Um, again, this is my video because I wasn't able to work with my other group members schedule. <laughs> Sorry. Um, yeah, thank you.